guys, and welcome back to King's Quest! As you guys can hear from my voice, I am disgustingly happy today because yesterday was a good day, I just woke up and I have a feeling that today is a good day, and I figure, you know, what the heck, let's go and record and share our happiness with everyone because that is exactly what preppy people do and I'm totally a preppy person today. <laughs> and so, you know guys, donned on the blue shirt, the cellularly blue shirt, Figured, you know, I love King's Quest. I really love King's Quest, guys. So we're gonna play that, and we're gonna record it, so it can go up tomorrow. Cause I'm technically recording it a day early. Anyway, let's do this, and we're gonna continue a night to remember. Now I realized that I wasn't at a save point when I had stopped. I think right in front of the knights talking about their nightlife, and uh, uh, we're going to. Do the test of strength, or at least we're going to attempt to do the test of strength. I, I don't know. Two rounds to get across. So, uh, sorry, I used yours. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. We're gonna try anyway. We have the the whistle. There was an extra rab, but Princess Madeline used it for herself. When she travels, she demands only the best. Oh, here we go! Hey, save point! You guys can't see it. Thank you! Ulfie is here to help. Thank you, Ulfie. I appreciate it. You can now... First, you know, we did help him with his, his blood sugar issue. Hello! I am here for the feat of strength. Tell can that smelly god when you're ready. Well, uh, I was actually gonna talk to you because my mount had been trapped. But, yeah, I'll tell the smelly guard. Although he doesn't- Hello there! Are you ready to begin? Yeah, let's try it. What are the rules? What exactly are the rules? The rules are simple. For a change, if you can stay dry, you win. Really? Okay. I'm ready. Let's do this. All right. Let the duel of strength commence. Probably not going to win this first time around, but we're going to try it. I'm glad we can settle this like gentlemen. <laughs> oh, oh, hey. <laughs> you want to see if that feather can fly? No, thank you. Owie oop. Aww. One step closer to Squirrel Nation. I got you, Graham. Oh, thank you. Hey. There's another horn here. No, that won't work. I wasn't going to toot that horn anymore until I found the missing piece. Let's try this. Oh, that was terrible. Now is probably not the best time for that. All right. Uh, what about? How about? Interesting thought, but no. Okay. Well, then that that answers my question. <laughs> All right. Well. Hmm. Oh, see, there's the other horn, guys. Okay, hold on. We're gonna cross, and then we're gonna talk to Ulfi. Ulfi, I wanna talk. Do I do I need to pull the horn again? Let's see. Yeah, still one more horn to find. Really? Well then, that was a clue. You should find a way to get all the horns. Gotcha. Thank you, Ulfie. All right. Well, uh, let's let's try it. I'm not exactly sure how, but we're gonna do it, and we're gonna find it. And is there any way I can climb this rock? No, it's just a pretty rock. Okay. You never know, guys. You never know. That's why you gotta explore your surroundings and figure things out. Now, there was a horn over on the other side. So, we're gonna go and do that. I wish I could push this rock down so that we can get those those roots, which is probably what we need. Uh, where was that horn? I wonder. I wonder. So, yeah, this way. There we go, guys. Look, I found it. I found it. I think... I think I found it. I may have spoke too early. I feel like I found it. It's down here, right? Uh, 
Did I speak too soon? Come on, don't embarrass me in front of my It's subscribers. a good thing we're auditioning potential oh, knights. I start it. <laughs> well then, guys, we'll just have to make do with what we got. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, guys, things that you will probably see yesterday, you probably saw a clip of something that is pretty rare. But, uh, I may do a little bit more here and there of, um... Mondays, Mondays we're, we're working on something, guys. We're working on something, uh, me and Viri, uh, to do the original something that we had planned before last Wednesday's incident, I guess. I feel like I'm walking around in circles. Let, let me go back, down, and then to the right. Because that's not the way to do it. Guys, I'm lost! I know where there's another horn. I know there's another horn here somewhere. Well, let's, uh... I wish you would automatically put on the the horn piece, because that would make things easier. But that's my only complaint about it so far. Thanks, Ulfie. You keep pulling me out of my meeting, and Ulfie hates doing the secret knock. What meeting? Wait a minute, what meeting? Well, we will go find out the meeting. Let's go into the dark spooky forest first. I press spacebar. Those woods were far too dark to risk taking another step forward. Hmm. However, we did discover something important. Well, first of all, we need to collect all the horns, and second of all, apparently there's a secret troll meeting that we know nothing about, absolutely nothing about, that we need to gather more clues and evidence of. I'm starting to question his commitment to our guild. He is a weakling. Hey, my coin! <gasps> yes, we got a coin. He needs to work on his time management skills. What's this? Right. Like, his better comes soon. What's that over there? <gasps> Guys, there's something over there, but I can't get across. Shoot. Well, okay, no, maybe. No, Pilar, I don't know if I'd say it like that. I could find a fast way down there, I would be able to hear the password. Nice of you to finally join us, Olfi. Merci. Olfi apologizes for tardiness. I, uh, was, uh, hey, where are the croissants? Let's see, I wonder... I forgot the croissant, okay? Oh, mon dieu. Just leave... Uh, shoot. Well, fast way down there, huh? Can I fall off here? Nope, okay. Well, uh, let's, now that we got a coin back, oh, continue. We can go and either get the lamp, or we can get that, uh, blade to free a cha-cha. Now, I think we should probably, s well, I don't know, a cha might be in danger. Hmm. See what, guys? We're gonna Thanks go. for getting Ulfie out of there. That meeting was getting heated. Yeah, no problem. Didn't have croissants, so I can understand. We're gonna go and get the lantern, guys. I think that's what we're gonna do. We don't have uh, frog's breath yet, but we will We will figure that out. Uh, but let's go and get that lantern and do something a little different. And then maybe possibly later find out a secret as to unlocking that path full of thorns so we can go and save a chaka. But, yes. Ochaka's a good guy. He can handle himself. I'm sure. I'm sure. Or at least that's what my character thinks, guys. I watch Rue's perspective. I know what happens. But! But, far be it from me to let something like that influence my character knowledge. After all, Ochaka seems... It reminds seemed... me of our son. <gasps> it looked like some type of broken lantern. Yes, I want to use it. Uh, two. Tab. Let's go ahead and use gold. Thanks, dearie. And here's your lovely pumpkin lantern with a glowing blue flame handle. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. All right, let's do this. First of all, we got that cave next to loyalty. I'm forgetting what... Oh, the mount's name is, guys, and I, I totally forgot to go back in that episode to watch, to see what the mount's name was. But it's okay. We're gonna go see what's in the dark cave first, and then we're gonna go see what's in the dark forest. And then... And then figure out 
clues and stuff and things, hopefully. Is it this way? I think it's this way. Yeah, it's this way. Oh, the music is so pretty, guys. Sometimes you just gotta stop and enjoy the music. Here we go. Serene. Felicity? Or something like that? Oh, hey, they all disappeared. Granted, I would be afraid of a glowing blue flame as well. That would be super hot. Oh, hello! Oh, that scared me. That may have scared me a bit. <laughs> You're kind of searching around, so sorry about the- Hi! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know this is your home, I just went through. Because I want my mount. Hello! Goodbye. Hello, I'm sorry. Sorry, this is your home, and I'm treading in it. Oh, we got through, guys. Now, where the hell am I? <laughs> What's this? Bizarre holes were burrowed into the forest floor. Hmm. Where the heck am I, guys? What is that pretty bird? Where do these holes lead? Hold on. Oh, I can't. Okay. I was gonna ring my bell, see if anything happened. <gasps> Is that a gold coin? Hey, how'd my coin get down there? Yes! So, we have, uh, guys, we have coins now, so we can go and free a Chaka at our own will. <gasps> these bunnies! Hi, bunnies. Hi, bunnies. How are you doing today, bunnies? Oh, you're so cute! You're so cute, bunnies! Uh, Alright, we're going this way, into the autumn woods. Where do it's such a pretty, pretty scenery? Hep! Hey, there's those guards! And there's a frog! How do I get across? Not sure. I feel like I'm progressing a little too far. There's such a- <gasps> I hear him out! Where are you? Where are you? I'm coming! Uh, triumph? Triumph! That was his- How'd you get up there? All right, well, let's try and get him down. Triumph's stomach seemed to have led him into trouble. I'd have to find a way to get him down. Oh, shoot. Uh, and there's nothing around here, is there? I'm sorry, Triumph. Oh, hold on, hold on. What do I have? Um, Bell isn't going to do anything. Money isn't going to do anything. I am sorry, Triumph. Just... Just hang in there, okay? Hang in there. We're gonna we're gonna see if we can't find this. Find a way to get you down. Stay put, I'll be back with help. I promise. Oh the whimpering is getting to me, guys! That's such a sad whimper. Is there any way across? Those knights are the awesome. The awesome. <laughs> <laughs> See them roaming, roaming about Daventry. All right. Well, good news is, is we discovered how to get down there. Bad news is, is we discovered that we cannot free Triumph just yet. So we will figure something out. I wonder if these holes are the same one in King's Quest One, like the original series that I mean to do a live stream of, but never get a chance to do, of the go uh, goblins. And the goblins have, uh, stuff and things. Can we skip through this part? Too much walking, not enough dragons. Yep. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry. Oh, 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 Max Wright, I left a co uh, post asking if we could shoot the goatacorn. Not that I would really want to, but, um, I wanted to go ahead and show that my mouse can't move any further over to the left. So I cannot shoot the, the goatacorn. And any attempts to shoot the tree fall flat. It is quite odd, though, that the goat of corn is eating meat. I am not going to lie. I've brought that up in a previous episode. That still bugs me a little bit. Because goats... Well, goats are op opportunistic eaters. But they still mainly range in herbivore diet. So, I know that they will chew on, on 
on things. Things that they're generally not supposed to be able to chew on. However, that kind of comes from the fact that goats usually live in mountain type terrains. And where the hell am I going? Oh, right, this way. Um, and yeah. The, they have to eat whatever they can get because food may not be as plentiful as, say, a forest or a plains. Alright, we're gonna go and use our lantern here, guys. Oop, I need to step a little bit further and. Ooh, that's creepy. I'm sorry! Anything over here? Anything over here? Oh, what's this? Oh, why did I take the work order? What the heck? Okay. Well, we got a work order. Which means we can save our gold coin for, um... For later. Let's go this way. Nothing. Oh, wait. Something. <gasps> did we discover it? I could find a fast way down there, I would be able to hear the password. Where do you keep going, Ulfie? Ulfie has very important business to attend to. Uh, have the croissants arrived yet? Oh, I already told you. I forgot the croissant, okay? Can we please move on from the croissant? Guys, I feel like we're talking in circles here. You Probably think are. with his giant head, there'd be a brain bigger than a macaroon? Ulfie. You're so easily tricked into sitting down. You should stand up for our rights. Well, easy. But Alfie likes sitting down. <laughs> Helps relieve pressure <laughs> up my back. Look, Pilar, I'm on your side, but I need you to work with me. We need to build our bridges and get over this. What's a compromise we can all live with? Oh, there is no compromise. Those tiny ingrates go around stomping on the shoulders of giants with no thought as to who is underneath them. They climb the ladder of success and forgot who got them across their troubled waters. What's in it for us? <gasps> What's this? We will show them all what What's happens this doing here? when you cross the wrong bridge. Oh, geez, oh hey. I wouldn't go so far as to say they don't appreciate oh, hey. it, but by golly, I wouldn't go oh, so far hey. as to say they do either. Bridges don't grow on trees. Shortcut. They grow on us. Brilliant. If there we go. We did it, guys. And you know what? I'm going to extend the episode just a little bit to, to see if we can't. Or should I, guys? That should I? Tell you what, guys. The guards with pointy shoes Let's hurt Ophie's back. <sighs> so... All of us are aligned with the so, strategy. Tell you what, guys, what we're going to do is in the next episode, we're going to call Ophi away just to have him there, and then we're going to run, jump down, listen to the password, and get part of the test of strength. Hopefully, maybe, kind of, sort of. We'll see, guys. We'll see. Anyway, guys, thank you so much, and on to the comments. Guys, thank you so much for commenting on the last video and leaving all the likes and stuff. Guys, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Anyway. Our first comment is from Linda Kujawa. Great episode. I do think Whisper would sign his picture. I do too. First opportunity I get, I'm gonna have Whisper autograph the back of his picture and possibly he 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 cause him to drop out. Yes, because I am an evil genius. Yes. <laughs> uh, Max Ryder is from is our next comment. Kitty. He's referring to Freya. Personally, I like Baby, and I'm gonna post a picture of. Of baby here but uh you know that's my personal preference i'm totally biased uh shoot the unicorn goat or the goatacorn as i like to call it as you saw max i was unable to do it and max says he loves freya freya is her own she's actually sleeping on the bed right there as you can see from my messy bed uh she is her own brand is special i do like her though i can't i can't lie she's she's cute she's she's big but she's cute <laughs> <laughs> anyway guys thank you guys so much don't forget to post a comment guys i love reading them i love uh, in fact i've been trying to get into a habit of making myself post more comments of the videos i like so guys maybe if i were to do it you guys can do it too i certainly appreciate comments guys and that sort of feedback really helps me fuel more youtube stuff and puts a smile on my face and whatnot guys so help me keep smiling guys thank you so much and i'll see you guys later bye